Hi, I'm Sharon from Skin Mason's Tattoo, 71 Garfield Road, East in Riverston, and I'm the only tattooist here at Skin Mason's. I've been tattooing roughly now for about 23 years. Um, I started off, uh, luckily, through a gentleman that saw some of my artwork, and I was doing glass engraving, and he walked past me, he was a well-known tattooist in Sydney, and he saw my work and said if I could do that on glass, I should be able to do it on skin. Uh, so he taught me and I've been tattooing here professionally now for about three and a half years. Prior to that I was just pretty much solo. To get into tattooing for myself wasn't too difficult. Um, not like it is today. Today you've got to go through so much rigmarole to even get a foot in the door to a studio. Uh, back when I first started, um, I just was lucky enough to have someone willing to teach me. Uh, and then I just went out on my own. Um, but in the 23 years of tattooing, I've managed to advance my skills and, and hopefully yeah, satisfy every customer that I tattoo. When I first started tattooing, a lot of the inks you didn't buy in a bottle. You used to buy powder and the mixes and, and make it yourself and it was always quite dirty to do. You ended up with ink everywhere. Um, and the colours just weren't nearly as vibrant as a lot of the colours and stuff you can get out these days. Um, and therefore the equipment's totally different too. You know, the equipment that we use now, you can achieve a lot more artistically than what you could you know, 23 years ago. I do drawings, I, I mainly do pencil work. Um, I, I used to do glass engraving, but gone off that a bit. Um, just I do a lot of crafty things. I used to make suede handbags and um, jewellery, gemstone jewellery and all sorts of things. But yeah, this has been my passion for 23 years and now that I'm in a studio, I realise that that passion hasn't gone to it every day, so I'm just loving it. I couldn't ask for a better job. My preferred style would have to be probably Japanese um, and as well as grey wash work. Japanese work I love because you've got your, your dark blacks um, and then you've got your vibrant colours. Um, I'm pretty much addicted to dragons, so if anyone wants a dragon, I'm more than happy to do that. Um, but yeah, I just I love the colours and Japanese never seems to go out of style. It's one of those forms that yeah just looks great on skin. Grey wash I like doing. I like doing sort of intricate grey wash work. Um, and yeah, girly stuff as well, you know. I like doing yeah the bright butterflies and the flowers and yeah. I do some freehand, not a great deal. Um, my mother says I'm a perfectionist, I think I am. I, I'd rather get it down 100% on paper and then tattoo it. I think with freehand it's too easy to be caught up in the moment and not look at all the fine detail. Um, and yeah, I, I'd like to think that yeah, my tattoos have got the fine detail down pat and yeah, the way to do that is to you know, take your time, do a stencil. Yeah, make sure the drawing's 100% before it goes on the skin. I, I've been tattooing for 23 years. I was a bit concerned at first about working full-time in a studio. I was worried that being a full-time tattooist, I would lose the passion for the art that I was doing because I would be doing it day after day after day. However, every customer that comes into this shop is totally different and so therefore even if I was doing a southern cross on every person that came in the customer is what makes that tattoo different um, so yeah it sort of keeps everything alive. I'm Shaz, I'm sarcastic, I'm funny. Come and get a tattoo from me and you'll get more than your tattoo, you'll be entertained um, but yeah come down to Skin Mason's Tattoo in Garfield Road, Riverston and thanks for watching tattooing.tv.